Welcome to the Dickinson Diesel Heater and Stove Operation video. This video will show you how to operate your Dickinson Heater and Stove efficiently for clean burning. First you would engage your fuel pump or open the gravity feed valve to allow fuel to enter the valve. Now open the manual shutoff near the heater and turn the valve to the medium low setting to allow some fuel to enter the burner. Lift the lid or open the door and allow two tablespoons of fuel to enter the burner pot. Now turn the valve off. You may want to leave the superheater in or you can take it out during the lighting procedure. If this is the first time using your heater, then it may take a few minutes for the fuel to reach the burner. Now twist a small piece of tissue into a wick. Light it and place it into the fuel in the burner pot. If you remove the superheater, you would replace it now. Then replace the lid or close the door. Turn the fan on low to help burn off the priming fuel. And after about 5 minutes, the flame would have grown above the burner ring and then will drop back down into the burner pot like it's about to go out. Now turn the oil metering valve on to low to bring the flame back above the burner ring. Warning. If the flame should go out, do not attempt to relight a hot burner until it is cooled. Trying to relight a hot or even warm burner can result in an explosion. After about 20 minutes when the chimney is hot, the fan can be turned off or down to low. The flame should be burning above the burner ring with a vibrant yellow color. If not, then adjust the fuel setting a little higher until the flames are completely above the top ring. This is your low setting. Stay on low for 30 minutes before adjusting with small increments every 5 minutes. This is your optimal running condition and is achieved by getting the proper fuel and air mixture. You do not want a large, lazy orange flame with black tip. This is burning too rich and will produce soot and waste fuel. You also don't want your flame burning inside the pot. This is burning too lean and produces carbon buildup inside your burner. To keep the heater or stove burning clean, you must maintain the correct fuel to air mixture. By adjusting your valve, fan, and barometric damper, you can achieve the right mixture resulting in a lemon yellow medium sized flame. The key to a perfect flame is to find your range on the valve adjusting knob. Diesel fuel changes viscosity with temperature, so operating the valve settings and ranges will help keep the flow rate constant. The valve has five notches, one being low and five being high. This doesn't mean you can use the entire range. The valve can be divided into three ranges. Range one is used if the weather is warm and the fuel is thin. This would be settings one to three. Range 2 is used if the weather is average and the fuel viscosity is normal. This would be settings 2 to 4. Range 3 is used if the weather is cold and the fuel is thick. This would be settings 3 to 5. Stick within your range and you will find the perfect flame. Hope you have many warm nights with your Dickinson.